Interior CS Kidure Kindiki on a mission to reevaluate the security situation within Mandera County and along the Kenya Somalia border. It is at the Mandera border post where the CS felt there was urgent need to legitimize the entry point. Kidure adding that the government has been losing millions of shillings due to smuggling of goods via the unestablished border entry, which is also a security threat. Since Kama Serikari ya Kenya, to Kishirikiana na Serikari Jirani ya Inchi ya Somalia, Tumesikizana ya kwamba ni vizuri kuwe na mahali maalum na halali. Mahali watu wanaweza vuka mpaka ili kuwe na biashara ambayo itakuza eh, ii tauni yetu ya Mandela na pia bulahawa katika pande ile ingine ya Somalia. There have also been reports of drug trafficking, human trafficking and increased supply of illegal arms from Somalia through the porous border point. Kithure says that this has to stop. With the political leaders of this county and also all the agencies of government working here to put a plan which will be guided by the community leaders and the elders from this county to make sure that we initiate an operation to flush out armed militants from Mandera and Northeastern just the way it has been done in our neighboring country. It is possible. The CS gave relevant authorities a period of one week to reassess the situation at the border post unit and see how it can be renovated for the benefit of all. I have directed again the county security team to sit down with the agencies of government that are represented here, including customs, immigration, and all the other agencies to make sure that whatever infrastructural work that is required to make our border operation today, you assess the requirements, you make recommendations, provide the BQs and the costs that are required, and provide that information within one week from today to enable us to uh, renovate the border post and be able to restart our border. Clan leaders representing Gare, Murule and the Goria community submitted the plea to the national government. Drought, insecurity, stable supply of food and increased cost of living are issues at their heart. Hakuna LGO. Hakuna ya yote inakuja kusaidia kazi ya madera, kaubandi ya maji, aina ya yote. Kwa sababu, wale wa LGO alikuwa anataka kusaidia zizi wanagoba usalama. First priority, fungua kwa malango ya boda. The clan leaders were asked to put aside their differences and have one goal of purpose. As he continued engaging the locals, Keture too had Mandera police post. Here, he assured officers at the station of his support as the interior boss. From Mandera East, Keture arrived at Takaba in Mandera West. Here, a team of special operation group officers from the APS were ready to display their skill. While addressing the officers, Keture reaffirmed the government's commitment to improving police welfare with officers who have served for a long time in hardship areas to start receiving transfers. Officers who have served a long time uh, because there has not been a changeover for some time, uh, uh, especially those like yourselves in the formed units, uh, that changeover will be possible by the end of this month because we have uh, had officers who, who passed out and, and, and that will relieve us and help us reorganize uh, our security sector so that those of you who have served here for a while can also go and serve elsewhere. Mandera County has been one of the areas hard hit by terror activities as the Kenyan government engages the neighboring Somalia on strategies to combat terror. Tomorrow the CS is expected to tour Marsabit on a similar mission. Franklin Wala, K24 TV.